Hey guys, it is, what day is it? It's Monday, the 18th of April, and it is snowing outside. So that's just how today is going, I guess. Um, I am not super tired this morning, which is good. Um, I slept okay last night. I haven't been sleeping very well at all. Um, recently, but last night I slept pretty good. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to quickly say good morning. Um, I haven't vlogged in a while. Um, a lot of stressful things have been going on. Um, one of my grandmas passed away and the other is in the hospital. Um, so that's all I'm going to talk about that because, um, yeah, so that's just why I haven't been vlogging and just stuff like that. So it's a new week. Um, my grandma's still in the hospital, but it's a new week. So there's that. And I actually feel pretty good about being here today, um, which is nice, but it also like just is kind of sad because I haven't felt good about being at school and being at work in a while um but yeah I'm here this morning it doesn't seem like I'm happy this morning but I just haven't had my coffee yet and it's snowing outside and it's the 18th of April um I had a super cute like spring outfit picked out I have these like purple like light purple pants and I was gonna wear it with a white shirt and I well Colin woke up at like I don't even know what time it was like maybe like four ish um and he like looked out the window and he was like it's snowing outside and I was like no it's not I was like you're lying I was like it wasn't too or it wasn't cold enough to snow I was like I think your eyes are just seeing things and then when I got up it was actually snowing but it's almost time for the kids to get here so I need to get going and I'll talk to you guys later Hello guys, it is um, prep time. I didn't um, film anything at lunchtime because I had some kids eating with me at lunch. Um, it's been an okay day. Um, like I've been able to teach and stuff. They haven't been like doing any like interruptions during teaching time and stuff. Um, it is assessment week for both reading and math, which is just annoying. Um, they are optional, but I'm still going to do them because I still want to see what kids are where. Um, and I kind of like planned this week around doing assessments because I didn't realize they were optional, but, um, I just printed out. So these are going to be for tomorrow through Friday. Um, it's just a decodable, um, reading time is pretty normal. Like we're reviewing sounds, like we don't have to teach any new sounds, we got to pick what book we wanted to read. So I've just been doing like, I picked some spring fun, spring books, um, like with bugs and plants and stuff. Um, but then we've been doing, reviewing all sounds, doing decodables, um, spelling. So I'm going to have to fo fold those. Um, I introduced a new station today. Um, so we've been working a lot on long vowel sounds, so I think two of the stations are going to include long vowels. Um, there was a rainbow write with CVC words, but I don't have any more of those, and I don't want to try to make any more of those. So I think this is going to be one of the stations. So basically, they'll look at the picture and then circle the right spelling. It's pretty similar to this one, um, but with this one, they look at the picture and then use a clothespin. So they're kind of similar, but there were a lot of good hands-on stuff in this bundle. It was like a $20 bundle. So if I find something I like more than this, I'll probably um, just do, like do something else. Um, but I'm going to add that into there. Um, my, one of a kinder, one of the kindergarten teachers, um, found this because we're doing, um, she has caterpillars and she's going to let me 
borrow them um, for some time, like when I'm doing this. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be like a butterfly observation journal. So I need to make copies of this because we are gonna start this tomorrow. Um, so it's 12.44, so I think I'm gonna go and make some copies really quick. Hello and good morning. It is Thursday, no, Tuesday. Um, I wish it was Thursday because it was very hard to get up this morning and it's the second day of the week. So that's just, yeah. Um, really quickly, I just wanted to say good morning. Um, hopefully today's going to be a good day. I printed these out yesterday. I've had these for a little bit um, and I just used them up the other day but they are like little desk fairy things and I have a whole bunch of candy because a whole bunch of people brought in candy for our Easter egg hunt and I like did not need all that um, the families brought. So we have extra now, which is really nice. Um, so I'm just gonna go real quick and put these on the kids' tables that have um, a clean area. Hey guys, it's much later, but I had to go to Kroger after getting my allergy shots. And my Kroger has um, clothes, so I always look at the clothes and I got a couple things. But first, real fast, I cut my hair. It's not like super short uh, because I literally just had my mom cut off my dead ends because they just needed to cut. But really fast, I want to show you some of the stuff I got. So I got these pants. They're just like these like comfortable fluid pants. And I think I'm going to have to go back and get some more because they're so comfortable and cute. Um, and I was just trying on this outfit. Possibly going to wear it tomorrow. I might try on a couple different shirts. Um, yeah, so that is one thing I got. And then both of these are the same style. Excuse me. Um, just like a tan color. And then an army green color. But they are just kind of like jogger pants. Um, the brand is Zach and Rachel. And they were originally, I guess, $45. And they were on sale for $12. Bucks, so I had to get both of the colors. Good morning. I need to do a real quick outfit of the day because kids are about to come. But I'm just wearing this shirt that I got from Target. These pants that are like nice and flowy. And then these sandals. I have a cardigan on for now. But kids are about to come. So got to do some stuff real quick. And I'll talk to you guys later. Hello, guys. Um, it is lunchtime. Um, I think I had my unannounced observation today, which was like unexpected. Obviously, it wasn't unannounced, so it's going to be unexpected. But it's assessment week, so we like haven't really had anything new to teach. Um, I have been still doing... Um, so I think I showed yesterday that like I was planning to do um, this decodable picnic, but I decided just to save that for next week because we didn't get to it yesterday for some reason. Um, so I was like, we'll just save it for next week. Um, but like, yeah, so like it's assessment week, but I still have been doing some like normal stuff. Um, but a lot of today was just, so we started with our morning message. We did that quickly. Um, and then we, but yeah, so during assessment week, I try to keep it like as normal as possible. And I just try to get as many as the assessments done that I can during station time because we try to do two stations per day every day. Um, so I try to keep it normal as possible because kids need, kids need consistency. Our kids especially need consistency. Um, and any ounce of like difference can impact them like greatly and just sets them off for some reason. Um, so 
I try to make like during assessment weeks, I try to make things as normal as possible. So that's why like I still review all of our sounds and all that stuff. But I don't even know what I was saying. Um, but today we did just do like read to self and then um, went right. Okay, after we reviewed sounds and did our morning message, we just went straight into read to self time and then station time. Um, so I didn't really have them like spell words today or anything um, or read a decodable or anything. But during like as soon as I was wrapping them up from read to self time, we were going into station time and um, our dean came in and she had like her computer and everything. So I think she was doing my unannounced and I was going to do assessments during that time, but I was like, I'll just pull some kids and like work on stuff with them um, instead of doing assessments. So like it went fine, like the kids did good. Hello guys, it is lunchtime. Um, I obviously am about to eat lunch. I just had the hiccups, so I hope they're gone. But I couldn't vlog this morning because I was running a little bit late. But I got here on time. Um, for lunch, I just brought some broccoli, pepperoni, pepper. There's an egg down there, some cheese. And then I totally forgot I had these, but I got grapes and I usually like I put them all in this one and then another one. And I usually bring one of them to school to have for the whole week and I just totally forgot I had them until last night. So overall it's been a good day. Um this morning we did our caterpillar stuff because I don't think we'll have time this afternoon because I want to do this math worksheet um and I need to do math stations or have them watching number bonds probably having them watch number bonds so I can do some um assessments because I didn't go do this morning because I forgot that we had our playtime with the Playworks coach. So at 9.50, we had to go to that. And that was pretty good. The kids did pretty good at their game. Um, it was a fun game. Yeah, so it's been an okay day. Um, I like my outfit today, so I'm wearing just this white shirt. I kind of wish I had, like, a tighter white shirt or just one that had, didn't have, like, huge sleeves. Like, I feel like these sleeves are huge, but it's okay. It's still cute. Uh, then I'm wearing these pants. This belt is from Target. This is from Old Navy. Pants are from Target. This is what they look like. Um, I'll try to take, like, a clip of all of it. Um, and then my sandals again that ugh, I've been loving. So I'm going to eat real quick. It is really hot out. It's like, I mean, it feels really good outside, but it's hot in my car. Um, but school's over, clearly. I went and got my eyebrows waxed. It looks super good. I haven't had them done in forever. Like, I feel like it just literally makes me look like so much better. But this sounds weird, but the place I get my eyebrows done at is in Walmart. They're super good. They thread eyebrows and wax eyebrows. I've never tried threading. I'm too scared to, but I wanted to show you some stuff I got real quick. Um, so we're doing the ABC countdown and next Friday it's game day um, for G. And I'm super excited because we get to invite some parents. I think like we only can invite like five parents. Um, just due to COVID, they don't want like too many people in the classroom. But we really haven't been able to like invite people 
to school um, like and have like parent involvement really at all so I'm super excited um, but I really only have like two games um, I have like sorry and then don't break the ice so I just was looking at the games in there and shoots and ladders ended up being on sale for 633 and hi ho cheerio I love this game ended up being or it was like eight bucks um, so I just picked those up because I need them for that day and then just in general to have and I got a couple other things so I'll show you that when I get home hey guys it's 6 30 but I took a little bit of a nap um I decided to get up um I really want to I wanted to show you this stuff really quickly that I got so the first um thing I got was this dress so I think I have two of these that are like this style from last year um and I can't remember if I got a medium or large I went with a large because it was looked like it would be longer for me so hopefully that's the size that I got but I love these dresses they have pockets they're just super cute for the spring and summer um and they were only $14.98 so I just got one of them in this really pretty yellow color so that is that and then the next thing I got was in the guy section um but it's just this t-shirt just like a tie-dye t-shirt and this was $9.48 and the last thing I got was this bag so I had a bag that like when I stay at Collins I'll bring stuff in um and it was like literally just like a reusable um Kroger like grocery bag but it was like about this size and it broke um I've had it forever and I've been using it forever so one of the straps broke off and the only other bag I had was this one and this is just huge and like so annoying to carry like look at the size difference that's like a huge bag um so I saw this and it was $25 so I feel like that's kind of expensive for a bag like this but I thought it was cute and um would be good to use when I'm going to Collins and stuff so yeah hello and good morning guys I just wanted to say good morning really quickly um 7 46 woke up later than I should have and there was traffic so just now getting here but um I just gotta do, do a couple things too goodness I cannot talk do a couple things before the kids get here um but I'm wearing my cute dress that I got from Walmart last night it feels really good out already so probably won't even need a sweater um, but I'm excited for the day. It's the bubble day. My stomach is growling. I'm starving. Um, yeah, so it's the bubble day. Um, I think it's going to be a good day because the kids want to move the bubbles. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, it is lunchtime. Um, I think I vlogged real quick this morning, but I, so the other night I got, um, wing stop and I had some leftover chicken and french fries and I brought it to school and I didn't get to end up eating that yesterday I ate something else um and last night I got a salad from this pizza place so I brought the rest of the salad and I am going to put my chicken in there because I got boneless um so I am gonna do that